Sorry guys, I'm never in the center on my YouTube video, so I'm like trying to figure it out. I'm like over a little this way, over a little that way. I don't know, I'm looking at my viewfinder. I'm gonna try not to do that. Hi, I'm Natalie Gibson, and this is my YouTube channel, and thank you so much for being here today. I have a surprise for you. I'm doing another try on haul which is some of my favorite things to film because it's so much fun and I love sharing my opinions with you one thing that I want you to know is on my YouTube channel I am going to be the most honest most serious critic of every piece I'm gonna get because I want to share with you guys what I know and what I think and I'm not just gonna tell you something is good because a brand is paying me or anything like that so if you guys want me to review something because you know I'm gonna give you that honest truth let me know let, send me the brand and I'll buy a bunch of stuff from there I won't even message them and ask for like a hookup I'll just buy a bunch of stuff and we'll try it on together and I'll be your test dummy to see if you want to buy clothes from there okay okay so today we're gonna be doing like a little bit of an Amazon review we're gonna be reviewing things that I bought in the past like month or so that I love and stuff that I hate I'm really excited about what we're gonna be reviewing today uh, we're gonna start with some swimsuits which I am obsessed with you guys I got these in January and one of them is still my favorite swimsuit to this day the other one is super cute and it's just such good quality I thought I would mention it anyways so um Yes, I'm gonna insert some pictures and videos of me wearing the stuff in Puerto Vallarta because I got it for Puerto Vallarta for my engagement. Ooh, I didn't know I was gonna get engaged, so I was really happy that I had bought some really cute stuff so I could look real cute on our little like honeymoon, not really honeymoon, but like pre-honeymoon, I don't know, our engagement vacation. Okay, let's get right into this. We're gonna start with this swimsuit that I love, but it's not my favorite favorite of all time swimsuit like this next one is going to be. So this swimsuit is from Zaffle and Hun Bun. Let me tell ya, it is worth every cent. I've had this for nine months. It came bright yellow. It has dimmed a little bit, but it's still in perfect condition. And I've worn this swimsuit over a hundred times easily, probably more than that. I go out to DJ's pool almost every day and we swim. And that pool is heavily chlorinated and I wear this swimsuit all the time. So this is so cute and I'm obsessed with it. This is the top. So what I did, um, because the top was a little wide on me and I just don't already have any titties. And when you have a wide top, it makes your titties look even further apart. It makes them look smaller, uh, yada, 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 yada. We don't like, we don't like. So what I did is I crisscrossed them. Crisscrossed them over um, so that it can be tighter. And I do this with so many swimsuits. Now it's like a total hack. Um, but I crisscrossed it over so it would fit me better. And now it fits like a glove. You guys will see that when I show you. Um, also, this material is so good, hon. So good. It's so good. Okay. This one I got for, I just checked the price of what it is now. I think I bought it for around the same price, but it is $28.99 on Amazon, and I'm 100% confident if that if you buy it from Zaffle, it would be cheaper. You just wouldn't get that Amazon Prime so it's shipping, you know what I mean? Woo! You guys. You know how much I love the word cute, and I say it so repetitively all the time that it could be a drinking game. Um, this swimsuit, I can't even call that because it's so beautiful. Like, it's going to bring a tear to my eye. A new song. Um, you know, it's going to be this swimsuit because it's so cute and it complements your hips so well. I've seen these on Boutine for, like, you know, Boutine prices, so they're expensive. And it's pretty much the same thing. This is some random company on Amazon selling these for 20 bucks. 20 bucks. It's like 19 something. Um, yeah, it's called Fisting Cutout Bikini. $20.99. I don't think they have the color that I bought it in anymore, but they have like seven other colors and it's amazing in every way. Okay, so we're going to try those on for you and then we'll go on to the next thing. Like I said before, I am a lover of a deal, you guys. And these are nude. Super trendy heels that I got on Amazon. I literally just wrote down nude heels So I don't know the name of the company, but all of it will be in the link so you can check it there um, In the bio. I mean <laughs> So used to Instagram um, 27 buckaroonies and they're so comfortable I went and shot in these the other day and I wore them around for like three hours and hun 
when I tell you they are comfortable, I am not messing around with you. They are so adorable. I could wear them with this workout outfit I'm wearing right now and it would literally like spice it up. Like you can wear them with anything and they're going to be so cute. Uh, 10 out of 10 would recommend this. If you're anyone, you need these shoes. Like literally if you live on this planet and you breathe air, you need these shoes. They're perfect. I'm obsessed. Okay. So these two belts came in the cutest little bag. And the thing I love about these belts more than anything is first off, I've been wearing these belts like literally all the time. As you can tell, like the last 10 Instagram posts I've had. Look at that. You know how most of the time those belts get like those creases and they look all dumb after like the third time you wear them if you buy a cheap belt? Even the white one still looks good, huh? What? So yeah, 10 out of 10 would suggest that one. I would get it from the exact same brand that I got it from because I see them all over Amazon and I don't know if they're all the same exact belt or if it's better quality or worse quality. So just buy the one that I bought. So it's $17.99 for both of these belts. Um, and the other thing is, so th this belt's pretty small. Like it almost fits me, which is amazing. Belts don't ever fit me. I have a really small waist, so they don't fit me. Um, and I got the extra small size or the small size. I don't know. I'll put it in the link. Um, the bio, the bio. <laughs> um, but they give you this belt thingy that you can put in to the belt and you hammer it and it makes another hole that looks exactly like the rest of the holes which is ingenious and it's it makes such a big difference for girls like me who have a small waist and the belts never fit so if you have a small waist and you're like hun I need a just a bomb belt a bomb gold belt because we love in the gold lately I just I just I just Hooked ya. Okay, so listen to your girl. Oh, wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. These bad boys are just lol. Oop, I lost ya. Rerouting. Um, okay. You guys have already seen these on my Instagram for sure, Z's. Um, they're to die for, truly. And one downside is they are a little see-through. I'll give you that. If you're gonna be up in the gym just freaking ass to grass, squatting it up, deadlifting, bending over, and you're like, I don't want Jordan over there to see my asshole. Probably best not to get these. I mean, they're not really see-through, but they are a little see-through. However, I'm just wearing them for the purpose of having some cute biker shorts that go with everything. And I love them, and they're comfortable. And I dress up all of my athletic wear with, like, jewelry and a necklace, and I just don't care that everyone else thinks it's weird. So if you're like me, and you just love a good just easy casual biker short look and you only want to pay $12.99 a killer of a deal for it then you're gonna go with these bad boys if not I totally get that and it's fine like I get it you know if you don't want the cheeks to show in when you're bending over I understand why you wouldn't want to buy this product I know it's a big issue for a lot of people for me um, I just am not really going to be like working out in them, so it's okay that they're like a little see-through. Uh, now we're going to get into things that Nat isn't the biggest fan of. We have one more thing that I am a fan of, but a few things that I just, oh, they irk me. They irk me. Um, first is my ring light. I daily want to punch it. Daily. And I am not a violent person. I don't agree in punching things when you're upset. But when you're trying to take a photo and like your phone keeps falling out and like it won't stand up straight, it falls forward. It's just like the most frustrating thing on this planet Earth. Especially when you spent, I think it was 120 bucks when I bought it. It might have been 100, but now it's on sale for 88.99 because of course it is. It's a piece of crap. Don't buy it. Um, but yeah, so just be warned if you're getting into photography or YouTube videos, do not buy the Mount Dog Ring Light. You know, mount your dog. One second, I think I heard something. Dude, I always get freaked out because I feel like I have a stalker. Like, I probably don't, but I feel like I have one. Like, I feel like sometimes, I know this is going to sound really weird, but like when I'm in my upstairs bathroom, I feel like someone's taking pictures of me. Like, I hear clicks, and I feel like it's probably all in my head, like totally made up. I'm just paranoid. But it's been freaking me out lately, and I'm totally going to put a camera down there and just, like, check. Because I'm worried about it a little. I tried to show DJ the other day, but he couldn't hear it, so I might just be crazy. 
honestly. I take really good care of my costume jewelry because like I said, I'm on a I'm baller on a budget. I'll I am so mad about this because I spent 25 bucks on these three anklets, which I know is still pretty cheap. But I, I think I always get my jewelry for extremely cheap. And since I'm always taking so many pictures, I always want to switch it up and get new and cute stuff. But since I'm always wearing a gold anklet, I was like, you know what? I'll, I'll try this out because it says it's 24 karat. It's only 24 bucks. Like, yes, let's do it. And I'm pretty sure I was reading, like, I'm pretty sure in the description it talked about how it didn't tarnish. Um, I don't know if you guys can see this well. Oh, I'm gonna shut this door. I don't know if you guys can see this well, but literally, look at this. Can you see how tarnished that middle one is already? It has absolutely no gold left on it. And I have had this for two weeks. And I have worn it three times. Three times, you guys. I did not put it into water. I did not do anything to it. I wore it three times. And it already, the middle one has no gold left on it. 24 karat gold my ass they literally took like one millimeter of gold put a bunch of water in it and just dipped it in there and knew it was going to come off and knew they were selling a crappy product that was going to tarnish and the thing is like i get it like when i buy costume jewelry i know it's not going to last forever when i say costume jewelry it just means it's fake cheap stuff you know um but it pisses me off when they try to like be like oh we're we're such a high quality product. So I'm expecting a high quality product and I get freaking Lulu Lame over here who's tarnished after literally a day. This is getting returned to Amazon and I don't like to return stuff that I've worn because I feel like that's super rude to do. Like, I don't feel like that's fair to, you know, the people who, um, who are selling that product. But hun, oh, you can tell a little bit better here. Look at, there's not an ounce of gold left on it. It's completely silver now, gone. It doesn't even match the set anymore. And this is how you can tell it's all from the same set and I got it all at the same time. Look at this. So they all have the exact same little bottom, which I think is kind of dumb because it hangs down really in your ankle. Um, they all have the same bottom with that little crystal on the edge of it. So it's all from the same company and you can like kind of see. Okay. So that was from, so you know what not to buy from them. Um, it's called the Monaco Coin Anklet. And the thing is, like, the other two look really cute, but, like, they're totally going to tarnish just as quickly. Worn literally three times. Whatever. I'm not in control of their product or making sure it's good, but I am a consumer, and if... You tell me something's good and it sucks, I am going to be just happy, upset, concerned. No, return that shit is what I'm gonna do. Oh, this is so cute. So I got this at the same time as I got that other one. And to be honest with you, I have not been as kind to this piece of jewelry as I am to let's say my anklets or most of my other jewelry that I have hung up so nice. This I've kind of been wearing all the time. Just been leaving it on the nightstand and not hanging it up or anything. So, I'm kind of surprised that it's doing as well as it's doing, but this one still looks so cute and just for like a little reference They were the same color as this when they came in I know it's bad, but this little this little guy is so cute. Also, if you don't already have a golden anklet Babe, you gotta get yourself one. It takes you up to the next notch. Like, get one and then tell me. You're gonna feel like the baddest bitch. The baddest bitch. Like, they try to market, like, makeup. Like, it's gonna make you feel like a bad bitch, which it does, don't get me wrong. But it's really the fucking anklet. It's really the anklet that just gets you there. Okay, I'm telling you. So anyways, this is really, really cute. So it's like super duper cute, just like a little layered necklace. When I first got it, I was a little bummed because I kind of thought for some reason that it was going to be three separate necklaces, which was dumb because I went back and looked at it and it did not say that at all. Like nowhere close to that. So I was a little bummed, but then like I wore it a few times and I was like, oh no, this is a whole vibe. A whole vibe. And ever since then, I have loved it and cherished it. 
So I think you guys we are at the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me You have no idea how much fun I have making these little videos if you guys want me to review any clothing company Let me know I'll buy a bunch of stuff from there. We can sit here and we'll review it just sheer honesty And I'll let you guys know if the product's good if you should buy or if it sucks and you shouldn't all right Well, I'll see you again next week Mwah! Bye So these are them sorry about all the mess freaking everywhere you guys i am literally in the process of like reorganizing everything right now okay you guys so i think these are so cute we're gonna do the uh the good old-fashioned mirror test to see if they're see-through but i think they're good to go so i think i can recant everything that i said about them before being see-through look how cute they are though and they give you that that booty vibe that booty vibe that booty vibe that booty vibe and just picture it you're walking in you're walking into the mall and you're just like comfortable and cute. You know what I mean? It's a win-win situation. The material isn't like amazing material. I'm going to be honest with you. It's not the best material. It feels like, you know when you were like in high school and everyone just wore those plain black leggings? Same exact material as those. Same exact, but I think they're awesome. I would suggest them for sure. Next thing that we're going to show you, just because, um... I have shorts on and it's gonna make it easy for me. Is this belt? Look how cute. Oh shit. Tell me that is now a whole vibe, my friend. It is. You don't even have to tell me it's not, because it's a vibe. It is a vibe. It's a vibe. It is a vibe. I know it's so cute. And the little gold detail on it is everything double belt it up double belt it down I doubt this is gonna look cute this is not fashion advice I am just being lazy if I'm just gonna be 100% honest though we're a double belt vibe we got both the belts on break it up break it down okay we're done with that I'm not going to show you guys the back of the swimsuits because um, YouTube hates me and they'll probably like freaking take my account down. No, I'm just kidding. They won't be monetized. I don't think this video is going to be monetized anyways, but if you want to see that kind of content, that kind of booty, you're going to have to go sub to my OnlyFans. So if that's something you're interested in, um, I will put the link in my bio or in my, yes, in the bio or the, sub, I don't know, whatever it's called as well. Excuse me. Did you guys know it was legal to have this much bazonka zonk? You didn't, but that's okay because you guys can't see it today. Not today, we're just showing you guys the front of the swimsuit and how it looks. I'll come a little bit closer, give you guys a little bit of it, a little detail on it. A little one, two, a little one, two. And I'll even show you the back of the top of the swimsuit right there. <gasps> we're living our best life. So that's what this one looks like. It has super amazing material on it. I love how high-waisted it is. I love the thick band on it. It really just slims you. It really brings you in and it just snatches that waist. A snatch of one, two, a snatch of three, four, and a snatch of five, six. We're on vacation. We got a mimosa in our hand and we're living our best life right now. That's what I feel like when I put this swimsuit on. And I'll insert some cute little photos and videos from this swimsuit when I'm in Puerto Vallarta. That was back when I had some boobies though because I was still breastfeeding. So don't mind the itty bitty titty committee because I'm the president of that club. So I know y'all are adults and I don't need to tell ya what you can and can't do with your lives. Um, but this is $20. This is $20. Let me say that one more time for the people in the back. This swimsuit was $20. And it's the cutest swimsuit that I own. Let's get a little close up on it. Let's get a little, a little action on the paction. Um. Excuse me, sir. We didn't come to play today. No, we didn't. Go get this for yourself. I don't think there's anything else that needs to be said. Check out the bio if you guys want to check out the links. Like I said, none of this is sponsored. Not getting anything from it. 
didn't get free clothes. I just want to enlighten you guys on banger deals like this for 20 bucks. Ah, oh, we love it. All right, guys, had so much fun chatting with you guys today. I will see you later, and I hope you have a beautiful and wonderful day.